So you were the Stockwell Day. You uh, you were a longtime politician on Parliament Hill, including the leader of the Canadian Alliance and a minister in Stephen Harper's government. So um, you knew Pierre Polyev very well. Uh, what do you think in general of what you're seeing here over the last couple of days? Well, it's interesting to have watched uh, Pierre Polyev over the years because I was actually the guy who brought him to Ottawa. He was the fir I was the first guy he worked for when I was MP there. And so I saw very early, this is a guy who can be focused. It's a guy who can do things that are seen as impossible because, as you may recall, very shortly after he arrived in Ottawa, he started knocking on doors and he won in an election against a very popular Liberal cabinet minister. So I saw early on, this guy is focused, he knows, he knows how to listen to people, and he's only grown in those areas over the years. So now do you think he can keep the momentum up because we may not have an election for two years? That's a great question, and it's going to be the challenge because, and it, you know, some people are already saying he, he was very specific about some things that he wants the government to do, his government, over the next, uh, we'll put in place over the next couple of years. That gives the Liberals time to go after it, to attack, and I wouldn't be surprised if they even adopt some of the things, the policy positions that he put out tonight. So that is, you're quite right, that's the challenge. When you lay it all out there, um, it's going to get attacked or maybe copied. So now, in general, he's gone up on the polls by focusing on economic issues, right. more housing, better paychecks, yeah. all that stuff. But this is a convention that has talked about social issues, and I'm just wondering if they hit the themes that you want. I mean, you have long been known as uh, against abortion. Uh, I don't know what your positions are on tra transgender rights, but there are people here that obviously would have maybe wanted the party to move a little more in that way. Do you think there's enough of that? I think when they hear uh, Pierre Polyev say things, for instance, that he wants to protect the rights of parents, and uh, how they love their children. That's, that's a general comment that people are content with. They just want that kind of recognition. Um, so I think that's why you see in the polls, there's an increase in the polls because he is genuinely inclusive. You see the increase in the polls among younger voters, increase in the polls among women voters, increase in the polls among the ethnic vote. He's touching on the things that matter most to people in all of those various sectors, and I think you're going to see that continue. It's quite a dramatic rise uh, that he's doing in the polls. So do you think he would be best to stay away from hot-button issues like abortion and restricting rights for transgender people and stuff? Would it be better for him to just leave those alone? Well, he hasn't said he's going to restrict any of those rights. Yeah, when he on the, the resolutions were talking about these issues. In terms of resolutions may have been. Parental, uh, you know, guidance and so on. Well, he's, he's supportive, just as he's supportive of families, he's supportive of parents, he's supportive of individuals, he's supportive of workers. What he's mainly concerned about is too much government oppression in people's lives. And he wants people to make their own choices. What cho you know, who do you want to be with? That's going to be your choice. And this oppressive government approach that divides people that we've had under Trudeau for eight years, it's really hurting our society. He's far more inclusive, far more wanting to see individual rights uh, be upheld and oppressive government taking away those rights. He doesn't want to see that. Okay. Well, thank you very much for sharing your views okay. and I hope you enjoy the rest of the uh, conference. Great uh, to see you. The convention, sorry. All right, great to see you. Thanks. Okay. See you.